After arthropods, nematodes are the most common animals on Earth. Many are microscopic, and so their presence in water and soil often goes unnoticed. They are so common that virtually every plant and animal has a nematode which can act as a parasite. They are unsegmented worms with a complete digestive tract, and contractions in the pharynx help to suck in ingested food. There is no respiratory system as gas exchange occurs through the cuticle. They possess longitudinal muscles but lack circular muscles and so it is the longitudinal muscle pulling on the cuticle and using the pseudocelome for resistance which causes their movement. They practice sexual reproduction and males are different from females, a condition known as sexual dimorphism. The males are smaller with a hooked tail and this helps them pass sperm onto the female. The larvae undergo molting and in parasitic forms different molts of the larvae may utilize different hosts. Roundworms of the genus Trichinella are the smallest nematode parasites and the largest intracellular parasites. They can be found in a number of wild animals including foxes, wolves, and bears and some humans who eat wild game uh, encounter the parasite through these sources. Most human infections are caused by undercooked pork. And one way to decrease the risk of infection is to eliminate the practice of giving pigs animal remains in their food. Parasitic nematodes of the genus Ascaris commonly infect human intestines and may infect one in six people living in the world today. They are most common in areas which lack modern plumbing, and the females can release 20,000 eggs per day. Water or soil, which has undergone fecal contamination, can spread these very small eggs if individuals are not careful when they prepare food. But even flies which visit latrines may carry eggs on their legs which then they can deposit on food if left uncovered. 